All right, my brothers and sisters, from the Bob Bait, this is to help the brothers and sisters and assist the brothers and sisters in their in their progress and in their um, growth and study. Right? Um, you'll notice that there's this particular document, right, that's on our study page, right? A A A H S I U Haile Selassie I or Haile Selassie First University Amharic 101. It's about a 24-page document, right? Mm. The 24-page document that we have here. Let's, let's zoom it in a little bit more sense so you can see it now. And it basically it summarizes um, the basic teaching, the basic courses, what we call the Line of Jewish Society New Millennium College Courses. Now, what do we mean by the college? Well, the universal. You understand? This is a universal truth. In fact, even in the heavens and the high heavens are paying attention to what's going on down here on this earth. That's why they see so many so-called extraterrestrials, angels, and demons. You know, demonic activity is real. You understand? Because there's a lot that's going on right here. This is like the center of activity in the universe at this particular time. You understand? At this, some say... And for for John, it, it is the center, but but there's a lot of activity here. But when we talk about the Haile Selassie, the first university, these are things that Rastafari, like the flag, have upheld in good times and bad times. We know that they removed His Majesty's name off of the university in Ethiopia. Well, they're lost, right? They're lost, but it's our gain, right? They're lost, but it's our gain. So so we pick up. You know what I'm saying? What they've dropped, we picked up. You know what I'm saying? They dropped the line of Judah off the flag, and we've picked it up. That's why I said we are that nobility, but we have to grow up and recognize how the government really operates spiritually, you know what I'm saying, psychologically, and then we'll be able to overcome physically, you know what I'm saying, in this world or in this earth and in this particular time. Yes, it's the last days and time, but that doesn't mean we just sit around and just fold our hands. You know what I'm saying? We're not to sit around and just fold our hands. There is work to do, and the work begins with the true faith, with having faith in the one whom he has sent, having faith in Yeshua HaMoshiach, having faith in the teaching of his majesty. So here in our HSIU, mm -hmm, because it's a line of Jewish society that has, we can say, resurrected, or this has been resurrected amongst I and I, this is a new millennium college courses. So what, what, what's a college? If we look at the college, the college is a secondary school. The college is mentioned in the Bible. We're not going to go through that, but if you study it, go to Blue Letter Bible, look up college, you'll see it there, get to the very root, search it down to the Hebraic root, and it'll, it'll show you. It's almost like the Mishnah. The Mishnah is like the college in that sense. If you overstand Shana. You know, saying secondary. You know, it's like when you hear the word, when you go to the next level to read the word, you're going to that secondary level. Some might just be listening to these vids, watch these vids, but they haven't really picked up to read it. We have to take it step by step, otherwise you slip. You understand? Know step by step. So we have to read it before we can even study it. Some say, well, they read it and study it. First, you first get familiar with it. You know what I'm saying? First, first store it up. First put it in your spiritual bank. Put it within you. Hear that word. Seek to receive that word and pray for the wisdom and the overstanding in that word. So in this particular document right here, uh -huh, this is going to be on Rastafari and the Bob Bait. And some of the Bob Bait pointers right here in connection with this 47th uh, RSS, Rastafari Sabbatical studies or, or Shabbat, Sabbath, Sendet studies. And here is the Arma. Here is the insignia. And so let's just practice a little bit right here. How many of you all say you know your Fidels? Right? Some say, I know my Fidels. And we want to give uh, um, certain um, uh, documentation, certificates to those who have completed the basic Fidel. You understand? But there are basic stages, steps. And we want to just go through some of those right here if we are able to. All right? So you ready? All right. Grab your pen and your paper and, 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 and your holy scripture, of course. But bring a willing and an attentive mind to receive the half of the story that has not been 
that has not been told to us, you understand, for all this time. But we give thanks for the revelation, right, for the arai, right, the arai, which means more than just to see. In the good is, arai, right, in the good is, right, excuse me, in the good is, arai means to see, right? Now, if you notice something in Amharic, it's ayya, right? This would be re-ayya, re-ayya, you know, um, ayya, so the ara, ara e ye ara-i, ara e ye ara practice, ara e ye ara ara e ye ara Arai, all right? Revelation. This is this Torah portion, right? So let's go to the HSIU and you can download this, the 101. You know, as you can download this from the uh, LOJSociety.org, the study page. Mm hmm. And it's Benetta. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's free. You know what I'm saying? Benetta, uh, right? So let's practice here. This is what? Ye, ke, da, ma, we. And degena, and degena means again. Ye, ke, da, ma, we. And degena, and degena means again. Ye, ke, da, ma, we. So this, 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 this ye prepositionally means of. So this is of, ke, da, ma, we. Next. This is ha, ha. Ethiopians, habashas, habashas, and those, they say, they say all the H is the same way, but we're not to follow after the way of the inhabitants of the land. This is what the Torah portion say. We're not to worship him like those who the land is spitting out. Otherwise, if we do what they do, they will spit us out too. Over. So this is ha, 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 ye, le, ha, le. Ha ye le, ha le, ha ye le, ha le. All right, and Degena, ha ye le, ha le, ha ye le, ha le. Next, this is sh or s, 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 sh or s is syllabated, not like regular s is s. Syllabated means se, 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 or in Gutters, she. This was the she in Gutters. Some say there was no she, sh, so forth and so on, but that's Wishitan. We can show abundant examples of words that come from Gutters that actually in Amharic, instead of using this letter, it will use the sh letter. All right? It will use the, the, the modification, the modified letter. All right? And we don't have it right here, so we're not going to touch on it right now. But the proper pronunciation is for us. Remember, this is kedush. This is for the kedase. This is when we're speaking holy. We can speak it like regular folks say, salase. But if we're speaking it in accordance with the word in the holy place, the mekades, right? The in worship, we must, we should pronounce it the holy way. That opens up the gate. That opens up the gates, and you can see this is like a gate in itself, right? This is like a gate in itself, spiritually speaking. Now, this is sh la se, sh la se, sh la se, sh la se, sh la se. Like in this Torah portion, speaks of the, speaks of the shalosha. Some say, well, Trinity is not in the, it's not in the, the well, that word is not in the Hebrew because uh, that, that's English. You understand? But in the Hebrew, we have Shalosh, Shalosha, and Shalosha Regalim, the three pilgrim festivals. Like the Muslims go and travel, Hajj and everything. These will be the festivals when the Hebrews would travel to Jerusalem, you understand, or Jerusalem, Jerusalem, right? They would travel there. You understand? So that's what I mean by the pilgrim. You know what I'm saying? They would travel there, and there's the Aliyot, there's the Psalms of Ascent, that as they approach and as they go up, it's the going up. So that was, remember, Old Testament was New Testament concealed. So that was a physical 
You understand? That was a physical movement. This is a spiritual going, a spiritual um, going up. Mm. Now, so far we have this, this, and this. Right, let's look at this last one right here, right? Because this is the Arat Nitib, you understand, which is the four dots, which would be like the period. So that would be the close right here, right? So this right here is you, you. This is ni, ve, ve, a modified letter, ve, right? Which is like the V right here, but with that bar above it, it makes the V sound, so it'll be a ve. This is for loan words or other words. You understand? So we can bring everything within the I and I matrix. You, ni, ve, re, si, ti. And Degena. You, ni, ve, re, si, ti. And Degena. You, ni, ve, re, si, ti. University. University. You know, you can accent it if you want to, but keep it in your accent. So you can get it, and then you can practice other accents. You understand? There was university, 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 right? So let's let's go through this whole thing now. Now that each one fidel that fidel, right? Ye, ke, da, ma, we, ha, ye, le, she, la, se, you, ni, ve, re. T. Ye Kedamawi Haile Shalase University. Right? And down here is the Targum translation. Haile Shalase I or first university. All right? Now, this is some good is down here. You understand? If one want to practice on it for a moment. Um, this would be Quillo. Quillo. This is Gutiz. Remember, this is more Bamarinya, even though it's in the Gutiz construct. But this would be Gutiz. This is Quill, Quill, Quillo, Quillo, Emekuru, Emekuru, Weze Shanaye, Weze Shanaye, Atinu, Atinu. Or actually, let me go through it. A Atinu. Ooh, 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 not ooh, not ooh, light, but ooh, ooh. It's a guttural. There's two A's. One is a high, one is a low. One is a feminine, one is a masculine. One has a high sound, one has a low sound. All right, those, those sounds are very important. You understand an opening when we're speaking spiritually, with faith. With faith in the right sound, word, sound, and power, it brings forth the manifestation. So, this will be roughly translated um, almost like all in, in, all being advised, counseling all, all being advised, and it's like um, in, in, in knowledge, this is really beauty, uh, Shania, but it also can mean um, 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 with Shania, beauty, but science, like we have, uh, what's the word, um, when they say Shinne. Uh, Shinne, like or sinne, sinne, like the science being strengthened in science, advising and all and 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 strengthening by by way of knowledge that knowledge strengthens. We'll go through the good is in a little more detail. Now here's the ciphers right here, the good is ciphers right here, which is this right here. But if we look at this, this will be this would be aser, this would be zetang, this would be meto, this would be hamsa, this would be arat. So literally, it's 1900, right? 1900, 1900, right? Asarazet Eng Meto Hamsa Arat, and that will be 54. So 1954 and 1961. This is the very same day as the Bible, and the very same year as the Bible. Mm hmm. The very same year as the Bible. So 1961 is a very important um, time. Now, another thing here about the seal, right, about the university seal, which is ours, as Rastafari in particular, as the LOJ Society. Of course, some of the Ethiopians repenting will probably want to restore the name, you know, and restore those things, the foundation of David, which are torn down. But until then, it is ours. 
You know what I'm saying? Exclusively. Because they've turned it back. You dropped it, we picked it up. You know what I'm saying? It's as simple as that, like the flag. Many of them are proud to wave the Lion of Judah flag, the, the Aranguade Beach uh, K flag with the armor of Yehuda Moa Andesa. But it was not so. It was Rastafari that kept the continuity of the government of the King of Kings. And this is still I and I responsibility, brothers and sisters, and we must restore the monarchy, period. You understand who, 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 we'll pray on who. You know understand, we'll pray on who's who, who will do who. But the principle must remain. If you notice this right here, here is the so-called six-pointed star. If you notice, the cross is right there. The mezcal is right there. This is kind of interesting that he would have the six-pointed star right here, not by itself, but with that cross. See, the cross brings it into righteousness. Many people may use this and say it belongs to Saturn and that and blah, 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 blah. They say, look, that's been used for that, and it's an idol and this and that. They're just looking at the shell game. For real, the sh it's like saying that because uh, uh, Satan, Yeteregame uh, Yehun, cursed be he, because he has the S in his name, we should not use the letter S. Because the A in his name, we should not use the letter A. Because of the T in his name, we should not use the letter T. Because of another A, we shouldn't use the letter A. We shouldn't use the letter N. Now, imagine if we follow that through to its full conclusion. You wonder why people are so stupid today. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Let's move forward because, uh, we, 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 you know, sometimes we, you know, get on the point. You know what I'm saying? Now, as we go through this right here, this is for the line of local 33 in the Federation, but they exiled I and I from it. That's all right. David was exiled, so we're in a dulam. We're in a dulam again. We say to them, I delem, I delem. We say, nay, nay. You know what Until they come, the king of kings way. So we prepared and composed for study and dissemination of our ancient Ethiopian culture and maintain the integrity of Ethiopia, which is our divine heritage by I, H. H. Ras Yadinos Tefari, for the Ethiopian World Federation Incorporated by Lion of Judah Local 33 Shalasa Shores, right? 33 Special Education and Fine Arts Committee of INI Society, since they exiled INI from Federation works. You know, and as they do with David, too many souls running around as balls, right? But be that as it may, you go through it, there's a basic, you know, we want to get through some of this. Why learn them hard? Malakwa Manu Obeyan composed this, right? This is I and I prayers. I and I and I sister wife, we publish this as well. This is the Ethiopian alphabet right here. You know what I'm saying? Study this. The ha, hu, he, ha, he, he, ho, le, lu, li, la, le, le, lo. Remember, the basic vowels e, u, e, a, a, o, except for the H and the A's. The first and the fourth, they pronounce the same way. Really, this will be he. You know what I'm saying? When we get to the purity of the of the of the kiddus, the holy. But right now, let's just basically get a basic idea. And again, ha, who, he, ha, hey, he, ho. This ha is inflected differently. It's like when you hear the Arabs say Muhammad, 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 ha, ha, ha. It's that sort of ha. This is more like ha, a soft ha, right? Now we have me, mu, me, ma, me, me, mo, the basic vowels, e, u, e, a, a, e, o, se, su, si, sa, se, si, so, or be, caduce, she, shu, shi, sha, she, shi, sho. We have re, ru, ri, ra, re, re, ro. Then we have se, su, si, sa, se, si, so. Then we have the Amhara modification. She, shu, she, sha, she, she, sho. Ke, ku, ki, ka, ke, ke, ko. We have be, bu, bi, ba, be, be, bo. We have the te, te, tu, ti, ta, te, te, to. We have the che, che, chu, chi, cha, che, che, cho. That's 12 asara shos. Now we have nugusu, you know, nugusu he or he, right? We have he, hu, hi, ha, he, he, ho. Practice make perfect all the basic way they say it today. Ha, hu, he, ha, he, he, ho. They flat, it's flat line today. You know what I'm saying? So the gates are also don't open properly. Anyway, um, 14, 
I mean, that 14 is ne, nu, ni, na, ne, ne, no. Then we have 15, which is a nye, like Spanish nye, nye, ni, ni, na, nye, nye, no. Then we have the, the alef, right? Which would really be e, u, e, a, a, e, o, right? And, and, and it's purity. Today, by Habashas, it said as a, u, e, a, a, e, o. And people say, well, why you got two a's there? Why, why this one? They say, well, that's how we do it. Okay, yes. But now we're here to repair that breach. All right? So it's e, u, e, a, a, e, o. Ke, ku, ki, ka, ke, ke, ko. Now, this is a modification here, too. Ha. They'll say, ha, hu, he, ha, he, he, ho. They'll say it very soft. Actually, this is the, w the way the first one is supposed to be pronounced in good. Right? But then we have 19. Um, I said as at N, we have we, wu, we, wa, we, we, wo, or some because of their particular pronunciation be like wa, wa, wa. So sometimes you have wa lid, wa lid, and, and they will pronounce the W as an O sound like this right here. So when it's written in transliteration, be W O, but really it's weld, but their pronunciation leads them to say world, all right? World, right? But so weld, we, wu, we, wa, we, we, wo. Then we have the harder a, or the ain, the ain, a, right? Which would be a or a, u, e, a, a, e, o, right? Then we have z, which is z, zu, z, 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 o. Then we have z, z. It's not z, z. It's more like the Z H, like azure. When you say azure, je ju ji ja je je jo. Then we have the ye twenty three ye u ye ya ye ye yo. Then we have the de de du di da de de do, right? And then twenty five haya a mist. We have je. This is more like the J, the J J, 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 right? You can see the DJ because if you look at the 24th, you can see that with the bar, it's been modified. This is an Amhara modification. 26 is G, 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 then we have 28, cha, chu, chi, cha, chi, cho. Then we have 29 is, eh, 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 u, pi, pa, 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 practice. 30 is, se, su, si, sa, se, se, so. Right? Now, here's where things get a little. Uh, interesting as well here too because others will say this the same way as this 31 as 30 30 right because it looks the same you might not be able to see it clearly there's a bar that goes through it it's like ain. it looks just like the ain because it's a harder sound it's a deeper this is more high set this is more it's a deeper sound Right? Then 32 is fe, fu, fi, fa, fe, fi, fo. Then 33 is pe, regular pe, pe, pu, pi, pa, pe, pe, po. Right? For loan words. Then we have a couple additionals right here. These are modifications. We'll go through it one time, but focus mainly on the 33. And then when you have that grounded, this becomes easier. Right? This will be que, qui, qua, que. Que, qui, qua, que. This is gue, gui, gua, gue. You know, like in Pato, gue, go away, go away, gue. <laughs> gue, gu, gue, gui, gua, gue. Then we have que, qui, qua, que. Then we have que, qui, qua, que. Que, qui, qua, que. As bechuala. Bechuala or bechuala. Basically, it's a W that, that merges, a W sound, a O. The W is actually what merges with this letter. You could t tell by the transliteration with the W right there. But the basics is the 33. Now, another practice, quick practice is A, D, C. A, D, C. A, D, C. A, D, C. 
Adise Adis Zemen 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 Right and the Adi Zemen or that acceptable year of Adoni Yah Rastafari according to Isaiah chapter sixty one verses one to three is the beginning of the true new age of Shalom or Salamu right or Shalomo his peace right his peace now this number was talking you know what they're talking about now with 2012 but a sign came in May 5th right now the prophecy there in numbers 24 and 17 says that there shall rise a star out of Yaiko and a scepter or a rod shall rise out of Israel it's one of I and I old pulses them hark literacy program some of this can be modified and various areas for others who are establishing churches or yeshivas the overstand for study right um, now let's go forward this is another chart right here without this, this doesn't have the English transliteration so one can practice test their knowledge all right now now this is what we want to actually get to this is the reason why we actually went here you can read through it Please download it. You can see the page that we have right here, the www.bible.org, the foreign, right, for, for, forward slash foreign, forward slash Amharic, right? Um, so we're using the Metzhoff Caduce right here, but let's go over the section one. Let's go over section one and just give a brief application of this for this Torah portion, speaking about the blessing and the curses that before us, right, have been put blessing and curses, and we have to choose this day today and every day you should make sure you're choosing because some days we might be choosing blessing and other days we allow the satanic cycle babble you know what I'm saying to make us think that oh that we believe more what the world is telling us or what the evil doers are telling us or what other people are telling us instead of being firmly rooted and grounded in God's word so the LOJ the line of Judah church and all local churches and fellowships and Bible studies and yeshivas, right? We sometimes refer to as the Ethiopian, the Orthodox school system, the real Ritua Hymenot school system. Biblically, it's described as the order or the appointment, the Shir'at or the Shumet, Old Testament Shir'at, and New Testament we find um, Shumet, right? The Shumet, and the root of the Shumet is Shiyumet, or Siyume Egeziyahir, which is the title of his imperial majesty, which is the title of his majesty that actually means um, the elect of God, or the one named of God, or the one named God, really the Shem. This is the Shem. So when we say Hashem, Baruchu, blessed be he, is a way of referring to Kedamawi Chayla Shalase, without having to say his name in vain. You understand that he is the Hashem. When we know who we're speaking of, he is the name. That is the name of the Ra'i, the Ra'i, right? That's the name of the revelation. So let's touch on this right here, and this will be like a part one for Nibabe, the house of reading. So Nibabe, te. Nibab Beit. Nibab means reading. Sometimes we may say Nibab. Minbab is going more to the good is Minbab, right? But Bamarinya will say Nibab. Nibab means to read and bait means house, right? Or one can say room in a sense. Mm -hmm. Really the square, and you know, if you, oh, if you can receive it. So firstly is the Fidele, the Fidel, the Fidele, the Fidel, the Fidele. So firstly, we have to distinguish individual letters to pronounce each letter from left to right, right, from the left to the right, and then from top to bottom. Now, this process is known as kuter, kuter, right, kuter. And kuter means learning by counting each letter, by being accountable, really, to each letter. Not going one, two, three, but the counting. Imputing, actually, that word is imputing or legosamine. Legosamine. Make a note of that. We'll touch on it. But look up impute in the Bible where it says impute, right? Impute is a very interesting terminology. It might be theological, but it's concerning the word of God, right? So by 
counting and being accountable for each letter, right? Also, we learn the names of each of the fidel. Each fidel has a particular name. As we get into the studies more, that will help many ones to distinguish. So if I'm talking about an H sound, and I say harm, harm, I'm talking about Nagusa, uh, uh, um, Nagusu or Nagushu, um, H, Nagusu Ha, Nagusu Ha, which is Ha or Ha, the Ha as in Haile, Haile, Shalase, right? So we learn the names of each of the Fidel, as well as the names of the seven orders or the seven vowels, the E, U, E, R, A, E, O, exceptions, H's and A's, A, U, E, R, A, E, O, all right? Secondarily, right? to help distinguish the different characteristics of the alphabet. Another table has been prepared, right? On this table or chart, the number of the letters and the forms of the seven orders, they remain the same. So it's still the same 33 by 7 or 231, and you do know that there are 231 gates, right, uh, in the cipher, the circle, right? Well, we'll touch on that. As, as as well. Now, um, so on this table, the number of the letters and the forms of the seven orders remain the same, but the place of the characters is mixed up or is changed, rather. So the pupil or the student that that comes as more can't depend on his memory and the sequence. You know, ha, we, ha, he, he, ho, but this is abu, gida, right? This is a different order, right? So in which he or she memorized. He or she memorized the characters. Uh, I'm just gonna be a little bit longer with this, my brothers and sisters. Please, please be patient. Um, yeah, the court. See, uh, uh, we're going. We're getting low, a little bit on power, when we we don't want to stop it right here. But if we have to stop it, we'll stop it right here, and hopefully, we'll be able to continue. You understand as we um, go forward. This is for the Nabab Bait. Right, because um, remember, it's, it's, the, the the gift of tongues is 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 given spiritually. It's part of it's part of our benefits package. You understand, as as sons and daughters, it's part of our benefit package. Um, let's let's put this in here. All right, let's see if we can. Okay, it's part of our benefit package. Right, so spiritually, you understand, we receive we receive it. Right. Okay, so the standard table, right, the standardized table is called Abu Gida. Abu Gida, Abu Gida, Abu Gida. You probably heard Teddy Afro has some songs, Abu Gida, right? Hey, with Zo, I think. Hey, with Zo, other letters. Anyway, from the first four letters appearing, so the first, from the first four letters that appear, like we say, Ha Hu He Ha, in that sense, right? Now, when the pupil knows the letters to some extent, he starts to practice reading text. He starts to practice reading the, the holy text and, and, and reading the Metaf Kedus. Generally, the first epistle of St. John is used for this purpose. And there's another chart that has been prepared, and you might have seen it, you might have a copy of it. And in the center, it basically has that first epistle of St. John, right? The first epistle, not the first chapter of St. John, but the first epistle, the Melikit, the Melikit, right, of Kedus, Johannes, the grace of Yah, for this purpose. But it says that we, I and I, will use H-I-M's Mechadim, right, or the preface, the preface of His Majesty's Met of Kedus. No doubt you probably have seen that previously. Right, now, the first four methods to practice reading the text are known as one, Mechadim, Secondarily, the good is. Thirdly, it's word, 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 word in the Bob. It's like word in the Bob, word in the Bob, or extended reading. Then, thirdly, it's kum in the Bob. The kum in the Bob, right? Kum in the Bob, kum in the Bob, which is complete reading. Let's go over this for one moment in, in this particular practice, right? A practice we want to deal with. So, stay tuned for the practice. Next part, all right? Shalom Rastafari.